Hey, what's up y'all, it's Don, and today we are gonna be taking a look at a few accessories from my friends over at Globular Cluster on Amazon. So they reached out to me by email and uh, said, hey man, we would like to send you a little sampling of what we sell on our Amazon store. And you know, I'm always looking for good accessories and one in particular caught my eye, which is the uh, the controller stand here for the, the index controllers. So I said, sure. What the heck? So today we're going to take a look at four different accessories that they sent me. Obviously the controller stand that I just mentioned. We're going to take a look at some headphones for the Oculus Quest 2. Really looking forward for that. Um, and we're going to take a look at a lens uh, pin to clean the lenses and a set of soft covers. So, all right, let's go. Okay, so let's start with the smallest and work our way up. So I think first we'll take a look at the lens pen that they sent me. Now, admittedly, I normally just use the old microfiber cloth here. I, you know, that, that served me well for years, but people have recommended over the time to use the lens pen. So there's, uh, the, it's got a little cap here. We've got to take that off. It's got the brush end right here. It is a very, very soft, brush uh, I do like that um, and then on the other end here it's got the uh, felt tip so I you know I guess I could see the advantages of that over the 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 cloth because I do spend time trying to get really really deep into the corners uh, so maybe this would really get you up in the little ridges where you can't normally get a microfiber cloth so uh, thank you uh, very cool I will definitely be putting that to use um, and uh, we are moving on. Okay, so let's move on to the cover. So I went ahead and put it on my facial interface for my Quest 2 here, just so we could get a better look at it. Now, I can tell you the things that I like about this right off the bat, it is super, super soft. I, I mean, absolutely just baby soft. I, I, it's, I, I love it. I mean, it feels great against my skin. Um, it is also really nice and tight up here at the top. They've got this, uh, the string that loops right behind here that pulls it and cinches it tight. Where it fails, though, is right here at the bottom. So since the Quest uh, 2 uh, facial interface is a full interface, they don't have it to where it comes all the way around or loops into the nose piece here. So so the cheek pieces here just kind of flap and dangle, and, and I just really didn't like that. I, I, I'm, I'm kind of a stickler about it. It has to be very tight and form fitting to the facial interface, no wrinkles. Yeah, I got that baby skin, I guess. I don't know. So anyway, comfort wise, great. Design wise, could have been a little better here at the bottom. Okay, so now moving on to a couple of my favorite accessories, which are first and foremost, the headphones. I, you know, I gotta tell you, this is something I didn't even think I needed because the, the audio from the strap is Passable. I mean, the, the Quest was okay. The Quest 2 actually sounds pretty good, but it still doesn't compare to having a true pair of headphones when, when, when they actually sound good and feel good. So, uh, you know, Globular De Cluster has designed these slide-on headphones that just slide right onto the strap. As you can see, they go on pretty easy here. You just slide on the left one, you slide on the right one, you plug it in, you tuck your wires, and now you've got a Quest 2 with full adjustable headphones. Now, it, it does leave some you know, wires visible. So obviously I wish that the headphones were the same color as the Quest 2 uh, to kind of blend it in. Uh, but it definitely with the facial interface, now you're kind of starting to create this two-tone. You know, I, I thought about doing the FrankenQuest mod with the Vive Deluxe audio strap. I have one just sitting over there, but I kind of say I like this design. I like how it just slides on and off for easy access. So I this is one I would recommend, guys. They sound good, they feel good, and you know, they don't really look great, but they're functional. 
Okay, so rounding out the accessories that Globular Cluster sent me is my absolute favorite and possibly the most useful of the bunch. So this is the magnetic charging stand for the valve index controllers and why that's a godsend for me is, is I am constantly forgetting to charge my controllers at the end of the night and you guys know I mean if you're into VR it's a pain when you get fully suited up and you're in your play area and you go to start playing a game and boom your controllers are dead so this makes it a no-brainer now I, I literally just slip them in the dock and they charge now that's all capable because of this little magnetic insert that they provide for the controllers you don't have to take it back out it's it's in there and now it has drop and charge capability the, the stand is also stylish I, I like the curve of it. it it doesn't feel cheap at all I thought it was gonna feel like cheap plastic it's actually got a nice weight it's got a rubberized coating to it so absolutely outstanding charging stand for your valve index controllers and i would highly recommend this uh, product all right so that wraps up our little mini review of the globular cluster accessories pack and i want to thank those guys once again for sending this out for me to check out for you guys so obviously if you liked anything that you saw here today i am going to have links for everything in the description of the video so just head to one of those links and check them out but for me that's gonna do it today guys thank you so much for watching to the end of this one if you made it that far and i will see you in the next one